So I ordered these and I opened it because I legit did not know what this order was. They came way earlier than I expected. They are closet organizers. My closet is in a desperate need of organization. I used to be really good about having like all my work clothes together, all my band t-shirts and tour shirts. And it's just kind of gotten to that point where now it's just a hot mess. I've switched like three jobs since the last time I organized my closet. And me and DC used to have been really good about like every year, once a year, we would empty everything out of our closet. So these are the little dividers. They look like this. Okay, I think I can get them open for you. And I did have dividers at one point and then I switched jobs. And so then like some of them got, you know, didn't need them anymore. And I, I you know, just over time, I didn't have labels either. They were like, I painted on it. So I could only like paint over it so many times. And then DC wanted a couple of mine, so then I was like, well, shit. Don't worry about all the plastic. It's so loud. It's so noisy. So, these is what they look like. The old ones I had were just round, and so they would keep pivoting constantly, and that was annoying because I couldn't see everything. So hopefully these will, like, stay vertically like this. And they come with stickers. So I want to do my closet a little bit different this year. I want to do like short sleeves, tank tops, long sleeves together. Obviously on my band t-shirts and stuff. Let's see. Pajamas, sweaters. Oh, okay. So it comes with like different ones. This one's like the days of the week, which I'm not going to do, but it's nice to have. T-shirt, spring, fall, summer, the jeans. Oh, and it comes with a blank one. Do look at that. So one thing that we do, it we used to do every year, I should say. We would empty everything out of our closet, clean the floor really good, organize and dust. And then we would put everything back in with the hangers backwards. Like we would hang the stuff backwards in the on the rods. And then throughout the year, as we wear items, we would hang them back up the correct way. So that way, the next year, when we would go to take stuff out, we already knew, like, hey, you haven't worn these four shirts in a whole year. Because they would still be turned backwards. And we haven't done that for at least, like, two, three years now. We did it when we first moved in here, and that was it. So, we also moved from... A smaller closet at our last place which is where we were renting and now we're in like an actual house so now we have like a walk-in closet so it's time I need to go through it and like I, I really do I need to I have like different job uniforms from when I was working in a factory to when I was working in an office position I had to like dress up every day and I have scrubs now and then I was working in a school which I'm not anymore but I have a lot of shirts from the school, like either with a logo on it. I have like the holiday ones. They would give us a shirt for pretty much every freaking holiday. And I just, it needs done, y'all. It needs done. So we're going to go do that right now. So this is our closet right now. And let me tell you, it is a hot mess. We do have some Halloween costumes up here and camping stuff. My Freddy Krueger outfit some random things. This is my side. That is DC's and that is all DC's. The bottom are shared luggage. And then this is just a hot mess over here. So I kind of have them organized a little bit. As you guys can see, this says band t-shirts, but you see how it like rotates and I can't see what I have. This is spicy stuff. This is long sleeve short sleeve and I had one here that said school but it, it's not relevant anymore so I took it out tanks lounging which has been moved and then DC has a couple but like you can't see them it's like band t-shirts but I can't I can't even read this shit so we're gonna work on that first we're gonna take everything out onto the bed make your bed 
and then we're going to put liked items together so like sleeveless together long, you know short sleeve long sleeve and then we're going to divide it even more so that is that is my tip is like all the long sleeves go together and then we work on individual piles separately so we'll work on the long sleeve pile first we'll divvy that out even more like black long sleeves white long sleeves like uh lacy stuff you know and it kind of really helps because i have like some painting shirts in here and you know when you kind of see them all together you're like okay i really only need like one tank top for painting one short sleeve for painting one long sleeve i don't need anything else so it kind of like you can get those piles down even more and then so i kind of call it like micro organizing we're organizing like sections first and then we're going to micro organize that section same thing with like my band t-shirts i would put them in a pile i'm okay tour shirts are first joker cards can go in another pile and then like other band t-shirts you know you can like divvy out and micro organize that pile and be like okay i don't need two riddle box shirts maybe i can get rid of one or whatever you know what i'm saying all right guys i got a whole pile there and i've already taken down about 10 shirts here is what we're working with i have dresses this is sleeveless. This is scrub tops, which most of them are in the laundry right now. Short sleeve is here. Band t-shirts, concert shirts are all here. Black tees. I have way too many and I fully recognize that. It's from when I used to work in a factory and I still use a couple of them for like painting and like splitting wood and stuff, outdoor yard work. We have long sleeve shirt, which is not that much. Holiday. This is like Christmas shirts. I have my St. Patrick's Day, Easter, Star Wars Day, May the 4th be with you, that kind of stuff. And then I have polo shirts. I kind of felt silly making a tag for this because I only have two, but when I need them, I need them kind of thing. And then formal. I went ahead and put my spicy, dressy, and formal all together instead of having it split up all over my closet. And I tried to organize with like, the, I wear the least until like I wear like the most. I mostly wear, you know, scrubs and t-shirts during the week and then my band t-shirts on the weekend. So this is what I mostly wear. So that's kind of just like on occasions. And then this is just easier to see up here. I had to put my dresses here because there's nothing blocking it on here. Whereas like all this shit down here, like the dress wouldn't be able to hang. And I also have a nightgown and I put my swim cover up in here. I know I didn't realize like how dark my wardrobe really is. That's kind of crazy. But I do have a little bit of color. Just, it basically has to have black or I'm not going to wear it. <laughs> Instead of wasting these old tags, I put the extra stickers on it and we're going to put that in our foster room. This is our foster room and our kids room or whatever you want to call it. We do have some clothes in here just accumulated and then we have like some more back here. We're just going to kind of organize it a little bit better and that way as we accumulate more free clothes or we get clothes for a really good deal, we'll have the extra ones. This is really nice because I can easily see like, hey, we have a lot of three months up to six and then we have like not very many of these. We need to get more of these. Is it ideally when fostering, it would be nice to have one outfit per size and then this is going to be like for smaller kids and then this side we want to do more like this style like for, you know, small, medium a little bit older kids. So this is kind of nice because then I can like look at a glance. Oh, we have enough of this or we don't have enough of that. So that's actually really handy. And I just put like the extra hangers up there. It's not ideal. It's a work in progress. This is still a lot of storage. I have um, DC's Star Wars Legos in here. My dad's vintage train set. More Legos. So we got to work on this closet. But this is a good start. <laughs> 